Hello my dear students, I hope you are fine and ready for the new school year. Ms. Shema Salem, hoping that you will learn and enjoy what we present to you today. So, let's get started. Okay, Unit 1 is entitled staying healthy so in this unit we will have a look and focus more on how to stay healthy as we all know that this year we were all suffering and we're still suffering from the coronavirus or the COVID-19 I hope that we will all be, be safe and sound so it's very important to stay healthy as much as we can in this unit we will focus more on how to prevent diseases or how to stay healthy as much as possible. Now I want you to look at this picture and try to tell me what's happening here. As we can see, a man is lying on the ground he needs help of course he's a patient and he needs help someone else is trying to give him a hand or is trying to give him a help this is called what first aid first aid is something you do for or to patients before they go to hospital okay so let me ask you a question here have you ever given first aid and if you have how can we do that read uh, the text about how to perform first aid in this unit okay paragraph one if you find an ill or injured person you must check the area around him or her first to make sure it isn't dangerous then move closer to the person and look carefully at them do they seem to be very ill do they have severe injuries? Paragraph 2 If the person is awake but not bleeding, you have to ask them how they feel and what happened. Check their body for signs of injury or infection. You don't have to touch the person's body to do this. Paragraph 3 If the person doesn't reply, if the person doesn't reply, touch their shoulder or their foot and shout to see if they react. And remember to check for normal breathing. Number four, or paragraph four, if the person isn't breathing, someone must call the emergency service immediately. Paragraph five, if you know how to perform CPR, you have to do this to help the person start breathing again. However, you mustn't do CPR unless the person is lying on their back on a flat surface such as the floor. Paragraph 6. Place your hand on the center of the person's chest. Put your other hand on top of the first hand and lock your fingers together. Make sure that your shoulders are above your hands, like in these pictures, step 1, step 2, and step 3. Number 7. You don't have to press down on the person's chest very much, only 5 to 6 centimeters. Keep your hands on their chest and allow it to rise up again. You have to do this 100 to 120 times a minute until the person starts breathing again. It's time for vocabulary. Let's learn together. CPR and CPR is something you do to help someone take air in and out of their body. Okay, they are suffering from severe, severe injuries. Severe is or describes an illness or injury that is very serious severe very similar to unbearable unbearable pain severe ok 
okay have a look at these two pictures yes technique technique and technique is a special way of doing something a special way of doing something infection Infection is a disease caused by a virus or bacteria. Infection. Infection is a noun, by the way. We have infected, an adjective. We have infectious, adjective, which means something that causes infection. Like when we say coronavirus is an infectious disease. Okay? but we can call the person an infected person a person who is affected by a disease of course this is a picture of the coronavirus a virus is a very small living thing that causes disease okay react react means to do something because something else has been done okay okay these are pictures of what as if we are trying to defend or to protect ourselves this is a picture of the immune system and the immune system is a way that your body protects you from disease and of course it's very important nowadays to keep our immune system by uh, eating certain uh, fruits and vegetables and drinking healthy drinks like orange juice and so on and so forth okay, finally with these pictures and they are two different pictures for the word perform perform means to do an action like here when you perform on a theater on a stage in front of audience and here to perform an operation okay let's exercise together easy we will answer everything easily choose the correct answer from a b c or d number one my friend was given by a doctor who i think saved his life was given what excellent cpr number two the young lady suffered head injuries after the accident and was in hospital for three months suffered severe head injuries excellent number three ahmed was given a small part in the school play which will be on the school theater which will be what come on yes which will be performed number four the firefighters quickly when they heard the alarm amazing yes reacted number five there are various for dealing with industrial pollutions there are various what i can hear you very good various techniques number six the policeman was from a wound in his shoulder was breathing was feeding was treating or was bleeding thank you was bleeding number seven the soldiers were lying on the ground as they were wounded or exhausted were lying what were lying rough healthy flat or active yes i can hear you flat flat means they did not move number eight always read the before you start using any new electrical set you buy 
Read what? Of course, read the instructions. Number nine, several people ignored the no smoking what and the police find them. The no smoking sign. Very good. Number 10. Scientists say that nearly 10% of the earth is what is covered by ice. The earth. Perfect. The earth is surface. Thank you. Good luck. Thank you all for your listening and uh, I hope to see you next time inshallah. Thank you very much. Bye bye.